What is up guys and girls, this is Ghost Robo, this is Grand Theft Auto 5, and I wanted to kind of talk to you guys right off the bat here, um, because this is, I believe, the 10th part in my series, and I know I'm kind of behind the times with these episodes. I had some multiple, actually, personal crises, crises, crisis I, uh, when GTA 5 released, and so I was unable to make the videos I wanted to at the pace I wanted to. Which sucks, but it is what it is. Life happens. So, my question for you is, do you want me to continue and finish this series? I know that other people are farther ahead, but some people, some fans, really appreciate my style of commentary and the way I play the game. So, if you're one of those people that really want to see me finish Grand Theft Auto V, hit that like button and let me know in the comments as well. Because I'm going to be deciding after this episode whether I continue the game or not based on your support. Um, what you guys want to do here, I'm going to leave it kind of in your hands. If there's a good amount of people that really want us to continue, then I'm going to continue it here on YouTube. If everyone's like, eh, we've watched it elsewhere, then whatever. Or if you want to watch it a second time with me, that's great too. I just want to hear from you and know whether you want to see this or not, because it is a long game, and I'm fully committed to finishing it if people are enjoying it, but this is kind of just sort of the, the line in the sand moment, the 10th episode, and the part where I want you guys to have a voice and have a say, and say, hey, Ghost, we want you to finish this, or eh, move on to something else. Um, so feel free to let me know your feelings in the comments below. Up that like button if you... Uh, Really want to see more, and let's jump in. It's going to be kind of a short episode because I'm really on the run right now from the cops. No, not literally from the cops. But we do have an incoming call from somebody. Yeah, who's this? It's Ricky from Life Invader. I know you're the bro who deactivated Jay, bro. <laughs> oh, I have no idea what you're talking about, pal. What you do is your business, bro. Anyway, Jay really got a big head once people started calling him a god. Guess you proved he wasn't one. They reintegrated my team in Burundi after the design got signed off. And now, my shares ain't worth dick. Sorry about that. I need work. And I thought maybe you could provide. I mean, I'm smart enough to track you down, aren't I? I guess you are. Hey, I'll be in touch if anything comes up. For a second, I thought this looked like Luigi. Heist crew member Ricky Lukens and Locke. Throughout the game, you may meet contacts who can help on heist. This will give you extra crew members to pick from. I'm going out of town this weekend. Um, so it's gonna be a shorter episode just because I'm running out of time, but I want to make sure I got you guys some Grand Theft Auto 5 action. Let's pick a mission. Where the heck are we headed? Where do you guys want to go? Those people that want the Michael mission, raise your left hand. Those people that want the Lester mission, raise your right hand. Lester is gonna be progressing the heist. Michael is gonna be progressing something else. Let's go towards Lester and, uh, set our target that way and see what he has to say to us so we can start rolling in the big bucks. I like this car. Might be a good time to start making some moves on the stock market. Here's a link. Okay, we can... You guys want to check out the stock market? Let's check it out. Is it an email? It is an email. Okay. Um, alright. Okay. Gotta take a quick break. Don't go Let's see. At all. Liberty City National. Tragic device explosion kills Life Invader C. Oh, that's not... Who did that? Alright. So you've got Life Invaders down, stuff like that. I've got $7,000. should probably wait till we uh, make some money. But that's pretty cool that you've got this full, like, faux internet browser in here to, to do your worst. Kind of really, really cool. The whole game is just really cool. I've been really impressed. I'm a little put off by the random violence. It's, it's just a little much at times, and it seems totally senseless, and these people have no remorse and no intention of really being anything besides crazy psychotic psychopaths. Uh, but you have to appreciate the game for how beautiful it is, how much it allows you to do all that good stuff. That you get all right. you deserve from people. Little wrong turn here. Now we're actually driving on the right side of the road like a normal person instead of a panther. Determined to wreak havoc across society's boring little face. All right. Lester, Lester, Lester. I've heard that the heists are the highlight of the game. Um, and from the very beginning of coverage on GTA 5, that was what I was most excited for when I read previews and such. Um, it seemed like the character switching in the heist was going to be the coolest part of the whole game. And uh, it should be really, 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 really fun. Trying to get a lot of my uh, my little trips and little fun things out of the way and family things out of the way um, the past few weeks and the coming weeks so that I can just basically lock myself in quarantine for the whole month of October, November, at least most of October and all of November when the new consoles come out and all the new games, so. I've been doing some of that, and then also just the, the personal and uh, medical anxiety-related stuff has just really put a thorn in my side, but I'll be back stronger than ever, just like I am right now. And like I said, if you guys want to see this game, even if we are behind some other people, that's all right. I'll just start pumping them out real fast for you. 
so it feels like we're on the right track. Do I keep missing the turns? I keep missing the turns. I'm just getting so carried away talking to you guys. Can I pick you up? She looks very sad. For a second, I thought she had fleas. All right. We're going to the warehouse of Lester. Lester, hopefully this is not another ambush. Last time I was here with a dude, it turned out quite poorly. All right. Um, let's go around back. Hello, is this an open door? There we go. I slept there overnight, apparently. Poor Michael. The hell is this place? Garment factory. I needed a job that didn't require me to do anything apart from uh, paying taxes. Okay, listen. What do you got? The Holy Grail. The Union Depository. And they say it cannot be hit. Has it been yet? Look. I just owe some Mexican hood a couple million bucks because I wrecked his girlfriend's house. I don't need to go crazy here. Which Mexican? Martín Madrazo. He's not supposed to be very nice. Oh, when I met him, he was charming. <laughs> so what do you think? Oh, um, let's see. Either we hit a bank in the sticks or we do a store. Which do you like? Well, <clears throat> store's usually easier. But I gotta make a big take. Uh, well, gems it is, then. Let's go to Vangelico, buy ourselves an engagement ring. Oh, we're gonna need a crew. I can round up some of the old guys. There are no old guys. Moses, uh, ironically, he found Jesus. Uh, all those Irish crazies, they mostly just disappeared. That crew from the south, they all went down. There was uh, an Eastern European guy making moves in Liberty City, but uh, yeah, he went quiet. Nico. All right. Well, we're gonna need a crew. You got any contacts in LS or not? I've been working with someone, but they're too unpredictable. I'll have to reach out to some other guys. And think about who we're gonna add to our crew. The jewelers is on Little Portola. Well, that's where we're headed then, Lester. Let me be your chauffeur yeah, and guide you. Buddies, they uh, know you're back in business. FIB buddies? What are you talking about? I checked out the WPP thing. Doesn't look like any WITSEC program I'm aware of. Well, for starters, they, uh, they don't put witnesses up in multi-million dollar mansions in Rockford Hills. Oh, maybe they thought this would be the best cover. And most witnesses don't transfer five-figure sums into a particular FIB agent's bank account every month. Of course, the money gets moved around and washed through a number of fronts, but the trail is there. Deposits and withdraws the same sum every month. Agent Dave Norton, white middle-aged divorcee, unremarkable career, except for one incident, the shooting of a notorious stick-up man, Michael Town. Yeah, 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 all right. Lester, I'm very impressed. Look, uh, we can talk about this another time. But take these glasses. My eyesight's fine. They're fitted with a camera and a radio relay. I'm gonna run the operation from the car while you're in the store getting what we need. High-tech Batman level-ish going on right here. Lester is a true Jimmy Neutron boy genius. With glasses and a cane nonetheless, but still a boy genius. All right. Watch out for floating traffic and get to our store. Feels like L.A. Noir here. Pulling over to the store, casing the joint, seeing okay. what's up. Let's get this done. Except we're not here to solve crime, we're here to cause it. What? Ooh. Da da da. Da da da. Am I going to caca here? No. Is this it? No, is it this place? Oh, it's around the corner. All right, I was gonna say it looked like it was kind of through there, but. Mm -hmm. Okay, we need shots of the security features, the alarm system, ventilation, cameras. All right, here we go. Vangelico, gelato, mulatto, tontonrato. Ooh. All right, I gotta get footage of the cameras. There we go. The alarm keypad is on the left when you come in, uh, on the wall by the side door. All right, what do we got here? Uh, surveillance and ventilation. Now all I'm after is the alarm. The shots come through. 
Camera check. Alarm check. Vents check. Hey, beautiful. I need to pick up a little something for the woman in my life. Well, one of them. <laughs> Sir, I'm sure we can help you. Tell me about her. What's her taste? Cheap. Thank God. This ain't my wife we're talking about. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to spend too much. I'm thinking maybe 10 grand. Our rings start at 8. Our pendants start at 12. All right. So these things built to last, or am I just paying for the Vangelico logo here? <laughs> no, 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 no. We use perfect clarity jewels. 18 karat gold, 950 platinum. Nothing but the best. All right. I think you just made a sale. I'm going to take a look around, think about it, come back to you, baby. Don't go anywhere. I understand. Okay. Thank you, sir. You got it. Come yeah. back to me. In case the joint, there is the vent that we were looking at, by the way, in case you didn't see what he was talking about. And as we walk the streets, so, a freaking good? criminal man. We need to get eyes on the roof of the building. See where the ventilation comes out. Oh, God. All right. Hey, what's going on? Eyes on the roof of the building. That's going to be an interesting treat. And one we'll have to pick up next time. Like I said, sorry for the short episode. I have to run. Let me know what you guys want me to do with the series in the comments below and with the like button if you're for finishing this game. Eager to see you guys have to say thanks so much for always supporting me and always being on my side. Until next time, though, drink so much. All have a fantastic day. And we will see you all later.